the, the three days, Thursday, Friday, and then Easter Day, are just wonderful opportunities for us to understand more about our faith, not only the basis of our faith, the good news of Jesus' resurrection, but also it's a reinforcement of our liturgical life here in the church. What we do each and every Sunday at each and every Mass gets reinforced by the Triduum experience and the spirituality of Holy Week. Some people come to me about the fifth or fourth week of Lent and they feel a little bit sad that they haven't really been true to all of their Lenten resolutions. The church helps us with that in the final two weeks of the Lenten season. Just reading the scriptures of each day prepares us for the special Triduum and Easter liturgies uh, that we've been preparing for for the 40 days of Lent. If people are wondering, uh, just how to make up for those things that they've uh, missed out. Take the scripture passages from last Sunday, get the scripture references from your daily bulletin, you know the scripture passages are being read each day. It's the drama that leads up to uh, Jesus' arrest and to his crucifixion, and uh, that's a good way of reminding our young people why we go to church during Holy Week. We're going to celebrate and commemorate those special episodes from the gospel stories about Jesus. Has the spiritual need to hear the words of forgiveness from Jesus, not just generic words in prayer, but individually it's important for us to receive the special blessing of absolution from the church so that we might experience in a personal way those things where we have failed to follow the gospel, those being healed and forgiven by Christ Jesus via the sacrament of the church. So since the uh, sacrament of uh, the Eucharist has an element of forgiveness, forgives us sins uh, for the many, we pray each and every time at the consecration of the precious blood it's important for us to receive Jesus' forgiving words. It's such an important part of his ministry. It's an important part of our renewal and spiritual renewal that the church engages in, not only during the season of Lent, but especially during Holy Week in preparation for the celebration of Jesus' Paschal Mystery made present again.